everyone. Welcome to The Works. I'm Jessica Kale Sheffield. And I am Haley Lane. And today we are watching episode one of G Gundam. And we hope you guys enjoy these highlights from the episode, and I will be drawing something I enjoyed from it as well. I, I think we just really need to watch the opening again, because talk about good animation. I am totally down. Let us do it. Ready? Yep. Three, two, one, go. Already starting off well. <laughs> Hot. <laughs> <laughs> Main character struggling, eh? <laughs> oh, bless. First pass animation. It's so good. I love that, like, that, that framing still reminds me of that thing from Babel the Second that, that Mon Pian edited. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I feel like this was happening because they hadn't finished animating the opening yet. <laughs> <laughs> there is a lot of animation that appears later in the show, too. That might be exactly what it was. I, I think that's what it was. <laughs> That's fine. Like, you know, we, we don't we don't fault the animators. No, no. It's also kind of hype when you see the bit of the opening animation in the show and it's like, oh, it's that scene. <laughs> Absolutely. I mean, you can you can definitely see the bits of animation they finished were like the cool, really cool part. Oh, yeah. So this this shot right here. Absolutely. Like just right out of a, a Kubrick film. <laughs> I mean, Imagawa is definitely a freeb. Didn't you say he was watching uh, or a fan of um, Twin Peaks? Oh, yeah. He loved Twin Peaks. <laughs> I've seen one episode. I think they just beat a Rocky for number of dogs killed in shortest amount of time. Wow. <laughs> what are we at? We're at two minutes, two, two minutes, 40 seconds. <laughs> oh boy, it's our favorite C-list villain. I love his design. Bombastic, fantastic, great laugh. A plus C-list villain. Yeah, we watched this episode in English first. I hadn't heard his Japanese voice in this episode. That was good. Hot detective. I'm already interested. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> it's like if Kenji met Zenigata. It literally is. I guess when you combine the Japanese and the French, you get Italians. <laughs> I love the universally recognizable, this is a detective kind of look to him. Yeah, everyone in Japan loved Columbo. Yes. God, look at the that, that little motion right there of grabbing the TV and, and dragging it towards the camera. That was so good. Yeah. Imagawa says Mad Max was great. <laughs> Also, I love these background character designs. Yasuhiro, every character is great, Imagawa. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Instantly. Wait, wait, wait. Yes. wait, 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 that, that literally was, hey, main character, are you here for the plot of the show, which is totally a tournament arc? And Imagawa said, have you seen this actual plot? I think they had too much green paint <laughs> oh at my the God. studio. Oh, I love that shot. That was a really well animated fist. Yeah. How dare you try to drag me back to the tournament arc? <laughs> <laughs> Here's a reminder. <laughs> oh my God. Imagawa really wanted to use that sound clip of a sniper rifle <laughs> shot. It's a good sound clip. It's just like one of my good cop, bad cop, American movies. <laughs> You're really going to make the animators draw this little photograph over and over? Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> so the Japanese heard the cliche about Italians will be like, no, 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 you have to eat. And they went, okay, I guess that would extend to the cops <laughs> too, right? <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> So basically, what it seems like to me is in Gundam Wing, they're like, you know when Domon ripped up that thing in episode one and everyone's like, oh, wow, he's so aloof and he's so, you know, just not caring. Let's just have Hero do that. Oh my God, did they do it again? Yeah, literally, he gets invited to someone's party and he rips up the invite right in front of her face. And then she's like, but, oh, but why? And then he walks by, wipes the tear from her face and goes, I'm going to kill you. <laughs> I've seen that scene. That's from Gundam? That's Gundam Wing. Oh that was the Gundam immediately after G Gundam. No way. That is absolutely the kind of series I would have watched 10 years ago, though. Oh, dude. I, I mean, that's what kind of got me into Gundam around the same time I was watching G Gundam. And I liked both for different reasons. Oh. But of course, looking back, it's like, oh, why do I, why do I remember G Gundam so much more? Well, th this is why. <laughs> 
they're just cramming every Italian thing in here. It's like, okay, we got the pizza. We got, you've got to eat something. We've got the mafia. Um, we've got the cosplay. Italy does like its anime. <laughs> it's a Gundam. <laughs> God, yeah, that was in Gundam Wing. Oh, is that what that's from? <laughs> that's what that's from. If, if they went, it's a Gundam, they would die. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I like how he's drawn there. He's our favorite C-list villain. He's great. <laughs> cool. Imagawa says feminine women can also be cool. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's okay. I'll talk to the main plot line. Don't bother. It doesn't matter anyway. <laughs> it's like, I, I am almost certain if I looked up you know, uh, Italian sniper rifle, World War II, it would be whatever the heck he's holding there. Because <laughs> that, that has been a very specific, specifically drawn rifle every time we've seen it. <laughs> there it is again. <laughs> Himikawa's like, I just think it's neat. <laughs> oh, the cool walk. Hey, it's the same okay, animation as in the opening. The scene. Yeah, I was, I was gonna say, I was just pretty <laughs> sure is. that they didn't finish the animation. <laughs> you were right, there it is. <laughs> Again, Thompson submachine gun. <laughs> I just think they're neat. Yes! yes! The, that's the shot of the episode right there. <laughs> it's like, they, they spent more time on like, no, 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 we gotta get this crest and him catching every <laughs> bullet from Thompson submachine guns. <laughs> it's unabashedly cool. <laughs> Japan's like, uh, what else is Italian? Uh, the Colosseum. Okay, let's destroy that. Wait, what? <laughs> Imagawa, I, I don't think you know what showing respect to other countries are. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> it's like, how, how many times has Imagawa destroyed the Eiffel Tower? <laughs> <laughs> the lights of Paris. <laughs> they are extinguished. <laughs> Yeah! We like to show our competent men struggling. That was the shot that I had to do for the off the cuff. I was like, there's no other. That's the one. Yep, that, that's the one. <laughs> Ladies. God, the animation is so nice on that too. It really is. See, this this is what Imagawa likes about the tournament setup. He's like, oh, okay. So so I'm, I'm going to have the Gundam command system just be them doing what they do. Yeah. It's like, fam, oh. say less. <laughs> 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 the freaking they just <laughs> ran Kalai. He's already wearing it. He's he just had it under just there the whole time. Ripped off his shirt and he's got the Gundam suit on. Yeah, this this entire fight is basically Imagawa going. Here are the mechanics. Please yeah. pay attention. I don't want to go over these again. So cool. He's having fun. The there's, there's the rifle again. <laughs> and and probably an accurate bullet for it, too. <laughs> I just think it's neat. <laughs> we could have had it all. Oh, my we God. We could have had it. I understood only too well. It would have been so cool. It would have been so fun. Yo. Protagonist. Cool. Oh, that's a great shot. Oh, it's cool. <laughs> <laughs> have you seen this plot? No, no I, I don't know anything about this plot. All I know is we got to sell toys. <laughs> I love it. I'm sorry. I just love that it's like a Japanese-sized pizza. <laughs> if, if that was actually Italian, it'd be like, so you're insulting me before I leave. Yeah. Just hands him a massive pizza box instead. <laughs> God. Here's that pizza so coach. Just like chucks a massive frisbee-sized yes. large box. <laughs> like freaking freaking breaking bad throwing the pizza on the roof sized pizza. <laughs> we could have had it. Could have had it. it. Would have made it so much better. But I mean, I'm already in with Anime Columbo. <laughs> Let's be real. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a simple woman. Very simple woman. I like detectives. <laughs> Just cool one guys. One more thing. <laughs> Just the one the more thing. <laughs> 
Oh God, no! That see, we we could have had that. Yeah. We could have had if that. If only they made it. But the dub crew, <laughs> the dub crew were cowards. Uh, alas, uh. maybe someday we'll get the proper dub of G Gundam. <laughs> alas and alack, but but we move on with our tiny pizza and lack of Italian accents. <laughs> <laughs> on to episode That was episode two. one yes. of G Gundam. <laughs> Thanks for listening. See you guys at the next one. See you guys. Bye.